No better way to end the work week or school week than with a little bit of fun. Just ask the kids at Sunnyside Intermediate School. Over a thousand fifth and sixth graders got a big surprise when a certain college football team showed up to hang out and share a little advice. We brought 80 football players and about 20 coaches, and we really look forward to talking to you about exercise, nutrition. What a great hour for both parties, not only not only the uh, students here, but also our players to be able to interact with these guys and show them the importance of, one, staying in school. I'm studying uh, sociology and history right now. The importance of education, but also the importance of nutrition and taking care of your body and making sure you do something every single day. Up, down. It was, it was really fun. It was a good time for not only the kids, but we definitely enjoyed ourselves as well. Definitely getting out and getting to the community, especially at school. Because right now you have to pay this to your teacher, I have to pay this to my teacher, I have to pay this to my coach. They taught us some things as well, because things have definitely changed since the last time we've been in junior high. I didn't realize how many people had iPads. Everybody has a whole lot of iPads. I mean, our faces of a lot of Snapchats, I guarantee. So it was definitely just good to see, just to make their day. It means a lot to me uh, to give back. Um, just with how fortunate we are. It carries over with everything that you do. It is important that these kids have a positive example um, to look up to. When they let uh, school out right there, that reminded me of my middle school back home. We just, you know, we'd run out of the halls and you know, we'd either go play soccer or something. We were signing arms and phone cases. It really was, it really was cool. One big ball of energy. Everybody's just moving a thousand miles a minute. We got bombarded by 1,300 uh, fifth and sixth graders, but they were awesome. Uh, the kids were having a lot of fun, and I was playing one game in one of the classrooms with my head down, my thumb was up, they were pushing my thumb down. I'm not sure what I was playing. And it, it, heads up, seven up. Oh, I've never heard of heads up, seven up. We can do our balloon boiler jacks for the last time. Well, it's hard to tell who had more fun, the kids or the players. Just this semester alone, the Boilermakers have registered 400 hours of community service. Very cool to see those guys getting involved.